This vehicle is from Westfalia. It is the Kepler 60 and as a VW uh, it does somewhat hark back to former times with this colour scheme, a colour scheme which incidentally has been used obviously by VW in their vehicles and it as well in the Saint and Sinner. So this is a Westfalia and it only comes in this colour I believe. So, uh, okay it's a car with some camping facilities tacked onto it. There you are, 62,000 starting price and anything else is extra. So it's 530 centimeters long, 190 wide, it's got a height of 199, 40 litres of uh, fresh water, dirty water, 30 litres and it can take a 1.8 kilo gas. It's got uh, the habitation battery is 100 um, ampere hours, four sleeping places, although I don't I wouldn't fancy being in there with three other people, well, there might be too many with three other people were, of course. And uh, you can have even six seats in there if you want. Also clones with cleaning facilities, as you can see. Right, so, uh, but I mean, it does look pretty good. It looks a bit retro at the same time as being modern. Well, that's my opinion anyway. Uh, chairs, great colour scheme. Uh, right, so you've got there your uh, kitchen. There you've got your space for your plates. Let's have a look at this tent up here. That system's just clean. I don't really like getting in, but anyway. Hopefully my shoes are clean. So I'll show you the uh, the kitchen actually. I was living in a VW T4 years ago. Well, not mine was actually mine wasn't any longer than this. Though it looks about the same from here. Um, it would be you know this is this is this is all right for the weekend. This is all right for some you know you take to work. Uh, where it is, you're working and then you use this for going out the weekends and things like that. That make, that makes sense, but you know, it is a bit tough without having proper washing facilities and indeed without having um, a toilet. But you know, you can, most cars don't have washing facilities and toilets either. But mind you, for 61,000 euros you can buy, you can buy a proper motorhome. And that uh, is something uh, I ought to add. Let's have a look in here. Oh, mind you, cars don't have fridges that size, do they? Nor do they have tents in the roof. Well, it says here, it calls it neo-retro design. I, I hadn't read that, but that was the word I think I used as I was speaking. So the, the, the couch obviously forms a, a bed as well. And have got this storage thing here. Which I can't open, so I'll... I'll I won't uh, mess around with it too much. You can buy these boxes sort of fit in the rails there and you've got they're held in by these uh, stopper things as you can see. So have a look around it. You can see you've got the electric coming in there. I, I mean the, the the, uh, the fashionable decals. Well, I think they're fashionable anyway. But, um, I think I think it looks great as a is a, 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 a fashion piece. I mean, it's not really very practical for anything other than being a car with 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 a sleeping facility added on to it. Nonetheless, I must say that Westfalia does have some other vehicles which are quite practical and useful and more about them I think in other films.